Okay. Yep. So we were just talking about uh, intervals and chords, seventh chords, seventh chords. and we were kind major of reviewing seventh, major. Seventh. As first we reviewed major and minor triads. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And I asked you what were so the notes in an A major chord are what? A B and E. No, no. no. It's not so fast. A C sharp and E. There you go. Okay. And actually, the first time you gave me the answer, you, you, you had A, D, and E. A, and again, D, and the, the, yeah. that's uh, a really middle. important set of num numbers be, or notes because yeah. those are chords numbers 1, 4, and 5, mm -hmm. right? So when we talk, the numbers 1, 3, and 5 and 1, 4, and 5 are really important in music, Yeah. right? Yeah, nice. um, for completely different reasons, though. Um, and, and one way to keep them different, to keep them straight in your head, is that 1, 4, and 5 is bigger than 1, 3, and 5 because <clears throat> 4 mm -hmm. is bigger than 3, right? Okay. And that is, each of those refers to a full chord. We're talking about three different three note chords when we're talking about one, four, and five. When we're talking about one, three, and five, we're only talking about one chord, the three notes that make up a chord. So it's like a, a level a lower in the, yeah, it's the triad, okay? So, um, and A, C sharp, and E, what, in order for a chord to be, a triad to be major, it has to be, the third and the fifth third have to be the notes in the scale. Yeah. Right, and then I asked you earlier too, or um, just what what is the, what was a third from D? Well, a third from D is F sharp. Well, or G flat. No, or G flat is not a third because G no. is G is the next <laughs> G, note. G is the next note. Okay. But but G, I didn't G, ask you specifically. Sharp. Well, the first time I asked you that, yeah, yeah, you said F, yeah. and I said that's right because yeah. all if all, all we care about is the number of the interval, mm -hmm. all you need is the right letter. Doesn't have to be. The, it doesn't yeah. have to be in the okay. scale. Okay. But if I ask you what the third of a D chord, is, D major is, then F sharp. F sharp. Has got to be the answer. Specific right? major. Right. Major. So Perfect. so every interval has a number that you can count on your fingers. You know from whatever, okay. and you always start on whatever you're counting on starts as one, and then whatever you get to is the name of the interval. But then it has a qualifying term too that narrows it, that pins it down because almost every one of those intervals can be multiple distances depending okay. on where in the scale it happens. Okay. Yep. So we always have to have a, a qualifying term, and the three most common ones for those are that an interval is either major or minor. minor. Okay. Or but fourths and fifths mm -hmm. are not referred perfect. are perfect. Yeah. So we use the term perfect, which means kind of well, it, mean, it basically means the same as major. The perfect intervals are part yeah. of the major scale. One of the reasons we use that term there is that those perfect intervals, the fourths and fifths, are the same whether the scale is major or minor. Mm -hmm. So in a minor scale, the fourth yeah. and the fifth are the same as they would be in the major scale. Um, but the, so to sum up everything we just went through here, every major triad can be can have a seventh added to it, mm -hmm. and there are always two possibilities for that seventh. Mm -hmm. And if the triad was major, one of the possibilities is well, actually, it doesn't matter whether the triad is major or minor. One of the possibilities is a major seventh, and yeah. one's a minor seventh. Gotcha. Okay. The major seventh is the one that's really in the scale, mm -hmm. and the minor seventh is the one we sometimes call a flatted seventh. Mm -hmm. To not confuse it with the chord called a minor seventh, which is what we're going to talk about next. Okay. Okay. So, um, but does that you got that kind of mm -hmm. okay? Yeah. So, um, to make a chord major seven, you always have to have the note just a half step, step. below the root because that's mm -hmm. the one that's in yeah. the scale, and then you lower it another half step to make it seven. Okay. Yeah.